this is Isla from Hot Essentials and today we're going to go over how I design my labels and how I wrap my 8 ounce body butters. Okay, so this is the label that I'm going to wrap around my 8 ounce containers today. It is 8.35 inches in width, 2.6 inches in height. So as you can see, it has all the important information that a label should have, you know, your name, brand, your logo, the scent. Um, the manufacturer, where it's manufactured, the directions, ingredients, and on the right hand side, it shows my batch number. So right now I'm trying to show you how to navigate um, the photos. So just type in, or just click the search bar up above, type in what photo you're looking for. So I typed in body, but I'm just gonna go with the photo I recently used. Click and drag and hold over the rectangle. So as you can see, you can just literally just drop photos and just change it like in a second so that's why i enjoy using canva so much and if you want you can also you know choose to edit the text simply by clicking on the box you know selecting all and editing or erasing everything whatever seems fit um and say the directions are the same you can just leave that alone or you know just edit it revise it as you go so once you have a layout already, you know, in there, designed and saved, you can just switch out the information and in the photos so quickly. And that is why I enjoy using Canva so much. So right now I am showing you how you can, you know, edit the image. You can choose to remove the background if you like. There are um, adjustments that you can make, such as, you know, the brightness, contrast, and the saturation. Um, there are other filters that you can apply and other tools. I don't really use it, so I'm just going to leave it alone. You can choose to crop the image, so say that's the photo you like, but that's not really the, um, the picture you want showing. You can just choose to press crop and drag the photo up and down. So as you can see, that large rectangle is what is going to show on the front of your label. So once you decide that that's what you want, you know, just click done and that will be the photo that shows on your label. Voila! Um, we also have, you know, you can flip the image, you can flip it horizontally or vertically. Um, easy peasy. And I like to use transparency. So right now I'm going to navigate to it. So um, I like to use it because, you know, sometimes it's kind of hard to use a photo and be able to read the text that's on the top. So what I like to do is just um, make the photo transparent so that you are able to read the text. So yeah, that was just a quick run through of the program that I like to use, which is called Canva. Um, I use ProVersion, which is $12.99 a month. Now that our labels are finished cutting, we can go and proceed to wrapping the container. Um, but as you can see, only two labels fit per page. So um, keep that in mind, you know, before printing out your labels, how many sticker sheets that you may need for the amount that needs to be wrapped. Okay, so this is the label wizard. Um, it's adjustable. There are two levels. Well, technically three, because if you're container is too large for the first or second level you can just lay it down flat on here but um this is what i've been using it's around 55 dollars on amazon and i don't know i think it's been pretty useful so as you can see there is like a black area on the top so this is where you would place your label and there is like a ruler size guide i don't really use it though but um, you can move it around. There is a knob behind. So as you can see, it's um, adjustable. So as you can see, it moves top to bottom. And there is also another attachment that you can buy on Amazon that allows you to do larger bottles, but um, it's not necessary just yet for me to buy it, but there is an option for larger bottles. Okay, so right now the label is on, it's fixed to the container. I am just going to gently attach the top. In reality, this is not how I'd actually do it. I like to use two hands because it just helps me to align the label much more easier. 
but as you can see it looks pretty okay um, you can make adjustments but this is pretty straight um, there is an air bubble here that I will probably um, you know release but this is what the end result looks like you know and it was actually pretty quick gonna continue wrapping the rest of the containers by myself I don't really want to bore anyone but um thank you for watching my video and wrapping my body butters with me